welcome back everyone so today i will be explaining that how to fix google chrome slow downloading problem on your windows 10 and windows 11 and how you can increase the chrome downloading speed in 2024 so i'll be sharing few effective and the best solution that you need to apply in order to fix this slow downloading problem so first bring up your google chrome browser then you have to click on this three dot at the right in top and from the suggestion you have to click on settings now here from the left in menu option you have to look for the system click on system and here you have to disable these two options that says continue running background app when google chrome is closed toggle it off then use hardware acceleration when available you also need to toggle it off now it will ask you to relaunch so click on relaunch now next from the left in menu option only click on privacy and security and here you will find clear browsing data click on it select the advanced option time range choose it to all time now here you can keep password and autofill form data unchecked rest you can check all the other options now click on clear data and depending how much data need to be cleared it can take some time so you will have to wait and once it's been done here only you will find the security option click on security and then you have to scroll down and you will find use secure dns okay so make sure this option has been enabled and by default it will be selected to with your current service provider okay so what we will do we will choose the fastest dns server so that we can get the better and fast speed so select the second option and from the custom drop down you have to select cloudflare or you can also go with the google public dns but i would recommend you to go with the cloudflare select it and once you are done you have to click on the address box at the top and delete everything now here you have to type chrome colon double forward slash flags hit the enter key and here you have to enable the parallel downloading so click on search flag and type parallel and in the suggestion you will be getting parallel downloading now if you read here it says enable parallel downloading to accelerate download speed on your mac windows linux and chrome or android so by default it will be selected to default click on the drop down and choose it to enabled again it will ask you to relaunch so click on relaunch and now next you also need to keep in your mind that if you have any kind of unwanted or any kind of malicious extension then you have to remove it so again click on the three dot at the right in top and then hover up on extension and click on manage extensions now here it will list you all kind of extension installed on your browser so look for the extension that you are not using or you don't need or anything that seems to be malicious then you will have to go ahead and remove it I would also recommend that if you have any extension like McAfee Web Boost or McAfee Web Advisor, then kindly go ahead and remove it. Additionally, I would also recommend that you can download any kind of extension, ad blocker extension, because it will be blocking the ad so that your pages and the downloading can be done more fast without any kind of interruption. Now, next, you also need to keep in your mind that your Google Chrome browser should be up to date. So click on the three dot again and then you have to come to help and here you have to click on about google chrome now this will be checking for the update and if there is any update available it will automatically update it all right after applying all these changes you can check back if you find the difference or not and still if not then from the left in menu option in the settings only you have to click on reset setting option click restore setting to their original default and click on reset setting again so once you have applied all the solutions now i'm very sure that slow downloading problem on your google chrome will be surely fixed but still if you have issues then you also need to make sure that your windows should also be optimized and properly tuned up okay so i have already created a video on that you can check that video in order to optimize your windows 11 so that you can get the fastest browsing so that's all guys for today hopefully you found this video helpful and if this worked for you do not forget to like and subscribe and i see you in the next video Bye bye